Hello and welcome to Rogue Legacy. I've been wanting to play this game for a while. I, the reason I haven't recorded it is because I was using the keyboard and mouse and that's really annoying. I just got my gamepad. So, although it shows Xbox controls, it's actually not. And it's in the style of a PlayStation controller. Also, it's slightly confusing for me because you know how it says A and Y and stuff? Yeah, mine are labelled 1, 2, 3, and 4. So, this is going to be fun. So, that's the one I'm normally playing on. So, we're going to actually delete this one and start a new legacy. My duties are to my family. I can't control this. But I am loyal only to myself. Okay, this is actually me now. I already know how to play, obviously. Yeah, I've got some oh, slightly weird control scheme set up. Because... In games when I change my control scheme, I rarely play with default. Oh, I can't even reach that. In my um, regular one, I have a double jump, which is actually really useful. Oh, what? Hmm. I know how to do all this. I also have like a phase shift thing. Oh, actually, I should let it attack me because when I originally did this, I noticed they didn't have a health bar. I wasn't sure if I could be killed. Also, when it shows, like, the D-pad controls, I can move with the D-pad, but you can still move with the stick. Also, the right stick, I can... If I go to the angle of things I've bound on my, I guess it's like action bar, or action buttons, I guess, um, I'll do those things. It's confusing to explain. So I can't pretty much not use the, like, well, I guess two and three <laughs> right now, but I could use the stick, but I'm going to use the buttons, so you might hear those. You can also probably hear the stick. Oh, look, it's the king. Oh. Do I... Whoa. His hat is a massive invisible wall. And then I start my legacy. So the whole point of Rogue Legacy is going through, collecting as much as you can, and then, sadly, dying. Then, the gold you get carries over onto your next hero. And... You can use that to buy upgrades and stuff. So we're going to get some lore now. Jur journal entry number one. Treason. An assassin had wooed in my father the king. To bring order back to the kingdom, he has sent my siblings and I on a quest to save him. Together we will venture into the cursed woods and enter Castle Hampson. This cursed castle has stood on the edge of the woods since time immemorial. But rumours say that within it dwells the item which will cure any ailment. Tonight I will get a head start over my brothers and sisters and set forth on my quest while they lay asleep. To fail this quest would be an embarrassment to my name. So that's, I guess, one of my brothers. I just wanna. Okay, I'm Sir Lee. So I'm guessing. Yeah, I'm guessing that Prince was is m this guy's brother. Uh. 
Not starting us off too easy, actually. Um, I'm not sure if I said this yet, but I'm not very good at this game. So, I might get to the point where I get, like, extremely stuck. And I might call upon some people to help. Since this game is tricky. Oh. Those eyeballs are really annoying. They can hit through terrain. They're like bloodshots. <laughs> Bloodshot eyes. Wow. As soon as possible, I will be getting the Shinobi class. From what I can see, it's pretty much the best. I'm pretty sure every class is an upgrade. Um like an upgrade class where like you can do stuff like mages have uh, like um switching between spells um paladin or knights that turn into paladins have um a shield i don't know what the shinobi has but the shinobi literally one-shots everything. I haven't found anything that it can't one-shot, but I do stay in easy areas. And I've already died. Okay. And then we choose the air. Because of the fact that otherwise I may not um, show off everything i'm doing a thing where i have to choose the middle no matter what because i know that if i see a hero with vertigo i'm not taking him so this means that i will eventually show off everything if that makes sense like it makes me know i'm not missing anything Yeah, see, Paladin. Now you can block. So, the upgrades work on building a castle sort of thing. And then I've unlocked the blacksmith. Oh, hell. Maybe you can help me. I used to be the greatest blacksmith in all the lands. But one day, the monsters of this castle attacked my smithy and stole all my blueprints. Um, read this next one yourself. I'm taking a sip. Without them, he can only make cutlery. Okay, please bring back any blueprints you find, and I can build the most amazing equipment ever. Ever. At a price, of course. Of course, like, I'm only helping him reclaim stuff. Hmm. Charge! Ah. One must pay the toll. Hmm. And this is... Well, we're back at the start. But, something's changed. No! Didn't work. What? I hate these zombies. They're only there within a certain amount of range. So they're pretty annoying. No, 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 no. Oh, oh. 
I'm too quick to jump down pits. Is there another route we can take? Because I don't like any of those places. At all. Let me just double check. Yeah, there's nothing down there. Fairy chests take no damage. Well... I need double jump for that, so no. What? I say what, but yeah, that was entirely my own fault. This is a big room. I jumped into a doom bus. The Barbarian and Endomorph. Can I not buy anything? This is the issue I have with this game. With that. I'm really bad, so I never get enough money to do anything. And then I get rooms like this because I have extremely bad luck. So this is fun. Oh. You're in a painting. I don't trust you. Greetings, adventure. I'm here to give you a chance of a lifetime. For the measly sum of 25% of your current gold, I will give you a chance to open one of three chests. One chest will triple what you paid, but the other two are empty. Well, I only have 10 gold, so sure. <laughs> Middle. Can I not? One chest? Sucks. Ooh. Awesome. That is actually a boss, so I'm definitely not strong enough to enter that. I'm only level four. So it's a bad idea me entering right now. This went to a different zone, Land of Darkness. I'm not going in that either. You need to be quite high level for those zones. They're just crazy. There might be quite a bit of silence here because my tryhard mode is just me going silent. As you know from other videos, for example, Pi Games 2. I'm also a major loot tour, so this will be fun. Especially in games where gold is extremely important. You, okay, you're coming alive. If they shake, they're a ghost. That refers to everything. Okay. You gotta remember that in life. If it shakes, it's a ghost. I'm a ghost. Woo! Like, if you see a chihuahua and he's shaking around, that thing is a ghost. And you need to kill it with a vacuum.
Speaking of vacuum, I have nothing to talk about those. Yay.